Hello and welcome to Papri. In this video, I am going to show you how you can create a text to speech bot for Telegram. What do I mean by text to speech bot? Let me show you first. So this is the bot in my Telegram account which I have created. I am going to just send some text to this bot and after sending this text, within few seconds, we are going to receive a reply and we have received that. And in this reply, you can see the audio file. Let's play it. To create a Telegram bot that converts text to speech, watch this video till the end. And yes, you can see the same text which we have sent just now within few seconds, the same text is converted into speech. We have the audio file of that. Now to create this kind of Telegram bot, we have to use an AI platform like Eden AI, which is going to convert text to speech. And to connect our Telegram bot with Eden AI, we will be using Pavli Connect, which is an automation and integration platform. So without any further delay, let's get started with the step-by-step -step process. The step one is creating a Telegram bot. So here you can see I am on my Telegram account. After reaching to your Telegram account, here in the search bar, search for bot father. And after searching for bot father, just select this bot father with this official tick. And then click on start. After clicking on start, send slash new bot to the bot father. Just send this message and then it is asking us a name that what is the name we want to give to this new bot which we are creating so let's say i want my bot to be named as text to speech text to speech pc this is the bot name i want to give to my bot let's send it and then after naming it it is asking us for a unique username so the unique username should end with bot or underscore bot as it is written in the example. So I'm using the same name and I will write underscore bot in front of it and send it. And after sending it, here you can see this new bot is successfully created over here. So using bot father, just now we have created a new telegram bot. This is the API token of the telegram bot which we have created. And by clicking on this particular link, here you can see that particular bot's chat is open in front of us. Just click on start and this newly created bot is now started. So the step one of creating this kind of flow is successfully done. We have successfully created a bot in our Telegram account. Now after this, what do we want to do? We want to connect this newly created bot with Pavli Connect. And to make this connection, we will be using this API token. So let's get started with Pavli Connect. Now here you can see I am on Pavli Connect's dashboard. Now to reach this dashboard, you will get a free sign up link of Pavli Connect in the description box below. By clicking on that link, you can create your free Pavli Connect account in just two minutes. And after reaching to this dashboard, just click on create workflow and give this workflow a name. So let me name it as text to speech bot for telegram. You can basically give any name of your choice. Then just select the folder of your Pavli Connect account in which you want to create this workflow and click on create. After clicking on create, here you can see a workflow is open in front of us. And in this workflow, we have two different windows. First one is the trigger window and second one is the action window. So triggers and actions are basically those two concepts, those two principles on which this whole automation works on, where the trigger says when this happens and the action says do this. So let's start with our trigger window. Now the idea over here is, first we are going to connect our telegram bot with Pavli Connect in the trigger window. So that whenever we or anyone sends a text message to this telegram bot, automatically the details of that message, that particular text message will be received inside Pavli Connect and this automation workflow will trigger, it will start. Then after that, using this Pavli Connect automation, we are going to send that same text to Eden AI. And using Eden AI, we are going to convert that text into speech. And in response, we will get the link, the URL of the speech file. After that, using the same public connect automation, we are going to send that audio file back to the same person, to the same user who has sent us the text message previously on our Telegram bot. So let's see how it is done. Starting with our trigger window, in choose app, search for Telegram bot and select it. After selecting Telegram bot and trigger event from this drop down, select set webhook and then just click on connect and select add new connection. Now here we have to connect our Telegram bot with Pavli Connect and to make this connection, we have to enter the token of our Telegram bot. 
So after creating the Telegram bot using Botfather, here in response you can see we have received the API token of this particular Telegram bot as well. So we will just select this token, we will just copy this token from here, we will go back to Pavli Connect and we will paste it over here. So this is the same bot which we have created and after creating the bot, we will be using this API token to connect that bot with Pavli Connect. And after pasting the token, just click on see. Now as we click on see, we will see our Telegram bot will get connected with Pavli Connect in the trigger step. After making this connection, just click on this save and send test request button. Now when we click on save and send test request, it has now changed to waiting for response. This means Pavli Connect is waiting to get some response, some details of a new message from this particular Telegram bot which we have created. So let's do it. We are going to send a text message to this Telegram bot. The message is for example, hello, we are creating a text to speech bot for Telegram. We are creating a text to speech bot for Telegram. So this is the basic message. This is the text message which I am going to send to this Telegram bot. Let's send it. Now as I send this message, because we have connected this bot with Pavli Connect, we will see in our Pavli Connect workflow, in this trigger step, we are going to get a response. And in this response you can see, we are going to receive the same message which we have just now sent to our Telegram bot. In this way, whenever any user is going to send some kind of text message to this Telegram bot, automatically the same message will be received inside our Pavli Connect workflow's trigger step as well. Now after receiving this message, what do we want to do? We want to change this message. We want to convert this message into speech. And to convert this text into speech, we were using Eden AI. Now to use Eden AI, just scroll down, come to this action window and here in choose Zap, search for Eden AI and select it. After selecting Eden AI, here in action event from this drop down, select the action event as convert text to speech. Then just click on connect and select add new connection. Now here we have to connect our Eden AI account with Pavli Connect. And to make this connection, just go to your Eden AI account and here at the home page itself, you can see the API key of your Eden AI account. Just copy the API key from here, go to Pavli Connect and paste it over here. And after pasting it, just click on save. And as we click on save, we will see our Eden AI account will get connected with Pavli Connect. After making this connection, the first thing it asks us is the text. That what is the text we want to convert to speech. So we are receiving the text which we want to convert to speech in our trigger step from Telegram. So whatever text message on Telegram we are going to receive in our trigger step, we want to convert this exact same text into audio or speech. So what we have to do? We have to basically map this response of text message from this trigger step to this action step of Eden AI. And the process of mapping is very simple. Simply click on this field and here in the drop down, you can see a list of all the responses which we have received from Telegram bot of a new message. Out of all of these responses, select this response of text message and it will be mapped. In this way, whatever text message the users are going to send to a Telegram bot, the same message will be sent to Eden AI to convert this text into speech. After mapping the text message, in this drop down you can see a list of different providers using which different platforms using which you can convert the text into speech. So we have OpenAI, Microsoft, IBM, Google, Amazon, LaboAI and Eleven Labs. You can use any platform, any provider of your choice. Let's say I want to use Eleven Labs this time. So I'm selecting Eleven Labs as the provider. Then it is asking us for the voice that do we want to convert the audio or we do we want to convert this text into speech of a male voice or for a female voice. So you can select the voice according to your choice. Let's say I want to use a male voice so I'm selecting male over here. Then it is asking this for the language. Now you can basically ask these details like voice and language in the message itself and using text parser or feature of Pavli Connect you can extract these details. But right now, I'm by default creating this bot for English language. So here in language, from this drop down, I'm selecting English. But here in this drop down, you can see a list of different languages. 
and here you can convert the text into speech for different languages as well for all of these languages you can set up this kind of telegram bot or what you can do you can turn the mapping button on and ask the language to the user in the message itself but right now we will be using english as the language at last it is asking us response as dict so here by default we have selected false if we select true the response is an object with provider names and keys when false the response is a list of objects so here if you want to get the provider details with names and keys in the response select true or else you can select false so i'm going with the default settings of false and after mapping the text selecting the provider selecting the voice and language just click on save and send test request button now when we click on save and send test request here you will see we have received some response and in this response you can see the audio resource url we have received the url we have received the link of the audio file to which we have converted so we have this audio file in which the text which we have given over here this text is converted into speech so we will just copy this url copy this link and paste it in a new tab after pasting this url here you can see just now this audio file is downloaded in my system this was the exact same speech for the text which we have sent to our telegram bot this means the step 2 of setting up this automation is also completed and in this step 2 we have converted the text to speech using eden ai we have the same language english and the voice of this audio voice of the speech is also me the same voice which we have selected over here now after getting this let's move to the final step where we want to send this speech this audio file back to the same user who has sent us the text now to do this just click on this add action step button over here and then here in choose app once again we have to search for telegram bot and select it this time after selecting the telegram bot in action application from this drop down we have to select the action event as send an audio file because we are sending an audio file to the user in the chat message then just click on connect and because we have connected our telegram account in the previous step we don't have to make a new connection just select the existing connection and click on save after clicking on save the first thing it asks us is the chat id that what is the chat id of the user to whom we want to send this audio file to whom we want to send the message so we want to send the audio file back to the same person who has sent us the text message so here in the trigger step responses where we have received the text message in these responses we have also received the chat id of the user we have the chat id of the same person who has sent us the message so here what we have to do from the trigger step response we are going to map this response of chat id in this telegram send an audio file action step and the process of mapping stays the same just click on this chat id field and from the trigger step of telegram bot responses just select the response of chat id and it will be mapped in this way whoever user is going to send the message to this bot text message to the same user the speech file the audio file of that message will be sent back then it is asking us for the caption so what is the caption you want to add with this audio file so here i want to add the caption as here is your speech file and then in this caption i want to mention the same text for which the user has requested the speech so we are going to map the response of same text which they have sent in the caption itself so from telegram responses from the drop down select and map the same text message as well here is your speech file and then we are going to map the same text message which they have given after caption it is asking us file url or file id so in this field we have to mention we have to enter the url the link of the audio file which we want to send so in the previous step after converting text into speech using eden ai we have received this url the audio resource url audio file url and we are going to map the same url in this telegram bot step as well just click here from the drop down from eden ai responses select the response of audio resource url and it will be mapped At last it is asking us pass mode and in the drop down we have two options html or markdown you can use any option i'm going with html and it is asking us disable notification that do you want to disable sending notification for this message so i've selected no over here and after entering all of these details after mapping the chat id from the trigger step entering the caption of your choice and mapping the file url from eden ai step just click on save and send test request
Now, when we click on save and send test request, here you can see we have received some response. And this response seems to be a positive response to us. This response shows that the audio file whose URL we have added, basically the audio file, the speech file which we have received from Eden AI after converting text to speech, the same audio file is now sent to the same person who has sent the message to a Telegram bot. So let's check it. We will go to our Telegram bot account. And yes, here you can see just now a Telegram message, a message with audio file is sent to the same person who has sent us a text message. Here in this message, you can see the audio file and here you can see the same message. Here is your speech file and we have the same text given by the person. We will just play this audio file. Hello, we are creating a text to speech bot for Telegram. And yes, here you can see we have the audio, we have the speech for the same text which the user has sent to this Telegram bot. This means the automation workflow which we have created using Pavli Connect, this automation is working perfectly fine. And using this automation, now whenever someone is going to send any text message to a Telegram bot, using this automation, we are going to automatically convert that text into speech and share this audio file of the speech back to the same person. Now after setting up this automation, let's test this automation workflow once. Let's say I'm going to send another message to this Telegram bot. So I have already copied a text, I'll just paste this text over here and then send this text as a message to this Telegram bot. So just now we have sent a message to this telegram bot. Now we will see after sending this message, automatically within few seconds, we are going to get a reply and the reply is here. In this reply, you can see the same caption. Here is your speech file and we have the same text message which we have sent just now. Also, we have this audio file URL. So let's try playing this audio file URL. Pabli is a suite of business management software that offers various tools to streamline different aspects of business operations. It includes applications for email marketing, subscription billing, form building, workflow automation, and more. And yes, here you can see we have the audio file for the same text message. We have the audio speech file for the same text which we have sent just now within few seconds. And this is pretty awesome. So this means the Pavli Connect automation which we have created between Telegram bot and Eden AI, this automation is working perfectly fine and we have created a text-to-speech bot for Telegram. Now you can either use this bot, you can either add this bot in your Telegram group, Telegram channel or you can sell this bot for some price to other users. You can sell the service for some other users as well. It is completely up to you. So not just this, we have plenty more automation tutorials already live on our channel related to Telegram bot and other application. And one more important thing, you will get the clone link of this exact same workflow in the description box below. By clicking on that link, you can actually clone this exact same Pavli Connect workflow into your own Pavli Connect account and use this automation workflow for free. You just have to connect your Telegram bot and Eden AI account and that is it. And also let me tell you, Pavli Connect offers you a free plan. And in this plan, you will get some free tasks every month into your own Pavli Connect account. So if you want to try and test this automation, you can do it for absolutely free. If you have any kind of doubts or queries, you can post them on forum.pavli.com. So if this video was helpful to you, you can obviously like this video, comment down to your suggestions and don't forget to share it with others. So guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you. Have a great day.